Liner projection is the amount that a liner projects above the block plate. Too much or too little liner projection will cause the engine to not seal properly, or worse, break a liner flange. We begin by inserting the liners dry and without any seals that could prevent the liner from sitting flush on the block. For this procedure, we want to install all six liners inside the block. The block plate shim gasket is installed, followed by a new block plate. The block plate is largely responsible for the proper liner projection of the engine. A block plate thickness is equal to the liner flange minus two to six thousandths of an inch, which is the required liner projection of the engine. The technicians install six special hold-down bolts and washers on the first liner being tested. These bolts will hold down the liner and the block plate securely so that the liner projection can be accurately checked. A liner projection worksheet is a valuable tool to use during this procedure. In it, we will record all the specified measurements for each individual liner. The technician uses a projection checking tool. Here, the dial indicator is measuring four thousandths of an inch projection. This is recorded and the hold down bolts are moved over to the third cylinder for measurement. The liner is checked in four locations around the liner. Each measured value is recorded on the liner worksheet. The hold down bolts are moved onto the next liner. The technician calculates the values on the worksheet and ensures that all the parameters for the liner projection on this engine build are within the specified limits. This completes the liner projection procedure.